going on guys? My name is Angel Gabriel and today I will be showing for you your good bacteria under the microscope and I also will be explaining how your goods made and some other facts about bacteria. So as you guys probably know or have heard about it inside of the yogurt, there are the so-called live cultures or active cultures. This means that there are live organisms living inside the yogurt. But those bacteria are not dangerous for us, they actually help us to digest food. So just to understand a little bit more about your goods, the way your goods done is by heating the milk up until a boil point to kill any unwanted bacteria and then once the milk has cooled down a bit for around 45 degrees it's added to the selected bacteria such as Lactobacillus bulgaricus and Streptococcus thermophilus. After these bacteria are added into the milk the yogurt is going to be ready in less than a day. Now let's make the microscope slide. I am using this Turkish yogurt that I diluted in water. The reason why I diluted in water is because it's going to make it easier for us to see and differentiate the different types of bacteria. So as you saw, there were like hundreds of bacteria in there, even though I just put one drop of that diluted yogurt. Okay, so now other interesting facts about bacteria is that they duplicate every 20 minutes on average. So now that we know this, question time. So how long would it take one bacteria to become 64, consider that every 20 minutes the bacteria is able to duplicate? So it would go more or less like this. One bacteria would become two and then would become four. So how long would it take to get into 64. I'm going to put my answer down in the comments and then you also can put yours in there. 